transfer replacement. In hint at new sporting director's identity, the Sun the Red Devils are expected to sign a big-name defensive midfielder this summer. And at the same time, a big player could leave at the end of the season. When his loan deal ends, Sofian Amrabat is likely to leave. Case Moreau could follow him out the door if the club wants to cut costs on wages last few weeks. The club was linked with Amadou Onana and Joao Neves. But Fischages says that Ten Hag has asked for Fofana to replace Case Moreau. United isn't the only team after the French player. Other teams interested in the 25-year-old player are Juventus and Paris Saint-Germain. He could be bought for 30 million euros to get away, man. UTD, ready to make transfer offer for 26 million pound France midfielder as Amrabat and Case Miro continue to struggle, the Sun Man United needs to set bigger goals than Fofana. Fofana has become a good holding midfielder at Monaco this season. He has won 4.7 duels and made 1.7 stops per league game. The Frenchman has won 58% of his take-ons, which is an amazing average of 7.4 recoveries. Fabrizio Romano on X, Excal. Inter approached AS Monaco in the morning to ask for loan deal with by clause for French midfielder Yusuf Fofana Manchester United. Also asked for the same conditions AS Monaco rejected both approaches as they, while there are some good things about him. He has had trouble passing and is only 81% accurate. The man from Strasbourg has been kicked out an amazing 15.1 times per trip. We don't think he's better than Case Moreau because of how he distributes the ball and how well he controls it. But we don't see him as a usual starter. He might be a good team player, Arsenal target. £30 million rated League One star as they consider potential backup plan if Declan Rice deal collapses. Neves from Benfica should be United's first choice if they want to get a star number six. Even though he's only 19, he doesn't have any real flaws and could fetch a nine-figure fee this summer, Manchester United. Looking to sign, Joao Neves plus more transfer rumours. The 19-year-old is one of Europe's hottest prospects and it is thought United are preparing a mammoth bid. For the teenager Benfica star Joao Neves is said to be high up on Man United's transfer wishlist this summer. Manchester United are reportedly readying a bid in the region of £100 million for Benfica starlet Joao. Neves, the 19-year-old, has continued to impress for the Portuguese side this season having already played 42 times in all competitions. The midfielder has been likened to former PSG orchestrator Marco Verratti given his never-ending engine and killer eye for a pass in the middle of the park with Kabi Menu and Case Miro seemingly Eric Ten Hag's go-to pairing as of late. Questions remain over the futures of both Christian Eriksen and Scott McTominay, especially given Ineo's incoming investment that is expected to see plenty of incomings and outgoings later this year. According to The Mirror, Neves is likely to attract high-profile attention from some of Europe's biggest sides this summer, with his name the next from Benfica's impressive production line of Portuguese talents over the last few years elsewhere. Reports from Football Fancast state how United are also likely to delve into the market to improve their squad at left-back. Both Luke Shaw and Tyrell Malaysia have spent large parts of the season on the sidelines and Girona star Miguel Gutierrez is one player continuing to catch the Red Devil's eye. The 22-year-old defender has been a standout performer for the Spanish outfit so far Both. this term. United have endured a difficult start to the 2023-24 campaign and they may need more signings in January. To get back into the top four, their scouts have been tracking a number of players all over the world. And manager Eric Ten Hag also has a list of potential targets. While looking back at our exclusive stories from the last four months, 
we've compiled a list of every player United are currently looking at. Defenders Antonio Silva United are desperate to reinforce their back line in 2024, and they are currently pursuing Benfica defender Antonio Silva. But Team Talk understands that United will have to offload at least one high-profile centre-back before they can sign the 20-year-old, who has an £86.7 million release clause. Jean-Claire Tadibo United were linked with Tadibo in the summer transfer window and look set to reignite their interest in the defender in 2024. Team Talk sources expect Nice, who are owned by Sir Jim Ratcliffe, to demand a fee upwards of £43.5 million for the France international. Jared Branthwaite Branthwaite has starred for Everton this season and Team Talk recently revealed that United are listing the 21-year-old as their prime defensive target from within the Premier League. But Sean Dyche's side will demand a mega offer if they are to allow him to depart Mark Gahey. Since joining Crystal Palace from Chelsea in 2021, Gahey has established himself as one of the best centre-backs in the Premier League. While Team Talk confirmed that United's interest in the England international is genuine, any move is going to have to wait until the summer transfer window. Lenny Yoro Yoro is enjoying an exceptional breakthrough campaign at Lille and his performances have caught the attention of some of the biggest clubs in Europe. Team Talk can confirm that United want to bring the 18-year-old centre-back to Old Trafford, as they are looking for a long-term investment, Lenny Yoro celebrating for Lille, Thiago Santos alongside Yoro, United are also interested in one of his teammates at Lille. Santos, who plays at right-back, joined Lille from Portuguese club Estoril in the summer and has managed to impress United's scouts. Goncalio Inacio While Inacio has been linked with a move to Liverpool, Team Talk recently revealed that the sporting defender is also one of United's prime targets. Edmund Tapsoba Tapsoba is currently on United's radar but we understand that Bayer Leverkusen are determined not to sell in January, as they are fighting for the Bundesliga title. Robin Lou Norman Doc Team Talk has learned that scouts from United and Liverpool have watched Norman play for Real Sociedad this season and they have been impressed by his performances, Jeremy Frimpong, even though Frimpong recently signed a new deal at Bayer Leverkusen. Team Talk understands that it won't be an obstacle for a potential move in future transfer windows. United manager Eric Ten Hag is a huge fan of the right-back, who has also been linked with Barcelona and Bayern Munich in recent weeks. Federico De Marco United are in the market for another left-back and Inter Milan's Federico De Marco has been shortlisted by their recruitment team. Sources have told Team Talk that they have watched the 26-year-old on several occasions and are keen to do a deal in January. Midfielders Joao Neves has become one of the most highly rated young players in Europe and United have been tracking the Benfica midfielder for over a year, according to Team Talk sources. But Ten Hag's side face major competition for the 19-year-old as he is a potential target for Chelsea and a number of Saudi pro league sides, Joao Palhinha Palhinha nearly joined Bayern Munich in the summer, but he returned to Fulham after the deal collapsed on. Transfer deadline day. Team Talk has since revealed that United have joined the race for his signature and Fulham are seeking a £60 million fee. Asan Awadrogo Awadrogo is enjoying an impressive breakthrough season at Schalke and has reportedly been billed as the German Paul Pogba. Team Talk sources can confirm that United, Chelsea and Bayern Munich have all taken an active interest in the 17-year-old midfielder, who could cost around pound 15 million. Forwards Serho Garassi Garassi has enjoyed a Sensational start to the season with Stuttgart and his form has caught the attention of a number of Premier League sides.